in this video i am going to show you how to render this sketchup model in d5 like this okay so click here to watch this full cinematic animation in d5 render or you can go to our channel to watch this full animation and much more to start rendering you need to download the sketchup file from sketchup.cgitips.org we provided the link in description so here we imported the sketchup file in d5 and the first process is to create a scene so d5 is very easy to use if you have a very good graphic card like RTX 3080 Ti or uh, 3060 Ti so here I am deleting this image because it seems no use to me right now in D5 you need to update the D5 scene again and again if you are changing something in your scene like you are changing the effect you are changing the environment or you are clipping the image for some good shots so make sure if you are changing something you need to create whatever scene you created you need to update it again and again here i am making the image invisible in ray tracing so sunlight can come into space it will not get blocked so this part we will speed up a little bit faster because in this part we are changing the materials giving the properties to the materials and setting up the overall color scheme for the space Okay, so second most important phase of rendering, interior rendering especially, is setting up the lightings. So here you can see I am using the rectangle light from the window to get extra sky, you can say the skylight or sunlight or the exposure in my scene. Okay, so this is the first step to get the light, to light up the scene. After adding this rectangle light, I will make some changes in my overall render settings to get good results. Here you can see I am not using the spotlight for ceiling lights because I don't want any spots to show on my uh, wardrobe or my walls in this scene. I just want to light up the scene. And so I'm using this rectangle lights again on the ceiling also with minimum intensity.
adding the ceiling lights and the rectangle lights into separate groups to control it afterward if we need. I am not seeing any depth in the outside of the window because of that image so I am going to add some real trees outside of the window to get the real effect in shadow. So watch the overall video to set up your scene and if you want the free file of this scene you can please comment and like this video so we can make it available for free for you guys